Fire that sent a young family running from their home to escape the flames this morning. It happened early this morning in suburban Northbrook, and the flames were so intense that two other homes were damaged. The fire department is still on the scene. Evelyn Holmes is live for us with an update. Evelyn. Well, you mentioned one family was running for their lives, two other families as well. Now, firefighters, as you mentioned, still remain here at the scene, putting out hot spots as this investigation gets underway into what caused this massive fire. Now, let me get out of the way, show you what we've got here. What you are looking at now, all that is left of this home where the fire began, that's where homeowners and uh, the neighbors say that they heard some sort of loud explosion. Now, incredibly, no one was seriously injured in this fire that engulfed this Northbrook house and then spread to two others. The massive fire broke out just after 6.20 this morning. That's when calls for help came from residents in the North Suburban neighborhood beginning uh, around uh, 6.20 this morning. Now, Chopper 7 HD was over the scene as fire and flames from a 211 fire consumed one of those homes in the 2500 block of Melanie Lane, then quickly spread to homes next door. Now, the uncle of the homeowner where the fire started says his niece told him that she heard a loud pop, then saw a wall of flames. She heard just the explosion. She was upstairs in her bedroom. And all of a sudden, she came out, and the whole st stairs collapsed down, and she was running down to the stairs to the fire, and grabbed her jackets. She couldn't go in the front, and she went in the back door to the sliding door, and she escaped, yeah. There was already extensive fire in the original house. Um, the first fire truck arrived about eight minutes after the first phone call and there were, the fire was already starting to extend to the neighbors' houses on either side. Now, the woman whose husband uh, was not at home at the time managed to escape relatively unharmed. The neighbors next door managed to get out as well and get his family out. Fire uh, on this block basically spread uh, most uh, to both sides of the homes. And then uh, firefighters struggled to put it out but did manage to. Uh, they spent the morning putting out hot spots before uh, this investigation into what actually sparked this um, fire begins. Now, uh, NICOR gas still here. Here at the scene trying to uh, secure their utilities as our other utilities who are here at the scene. In the meantime, um, fire investigators are just now beginning to get into that home just because there were so many hot spots they had to put out. In the meantime, uh, Red Cross has arrived trying to assist these three families that for all intents and purposes are displaced simply because that one house has just been destroyed, it's just been leveled. The other two have uh, extensive damage. Uh, they're trying to assist those folks, but in the meantime, uh, still kind of trying to wait to see where they can and pinpoint the origin of this fire and uh, simply what caused it. Reporting live from North Suburban Northbrook, Evelyn Holmes, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Yeah, big fire. We watched live here this morning, Ev. Thank you so much. And a lot of